Yo, what is going on, you guys? Awful parts. We're back here on Fortnite, taking a look at one of the battle pass challenges here for week number four of season five. This one here is going to be worth five battle star points towards your battle pass, and this one here is to jump through flaming hoops with a shopping cart or an ATK, which is basically your golf cart. Now, to complete this one, you need to get five different locations, and of course, once you guys complete one of them, you guys can't redo that same location. So once you do it, that flaming hoop is going to disappear off the map, and that's going to leave the rest of the ones that are available for you guys to go and go through. Now, this challenge is relatively easy. I'm I mean, it's really not too difficult and they've spawned a lot of shopping carts and ATKs around the map so that you guys can actually get this one done. Not every location that has the flaming hoops is actually going to have an ATK or a shopping cart there, but if it is there and it happens to spawn there, then you're going to be pretty lucky with it. But this is pretty easy. You only need to get five of them that you need to jump through. And the only problem with this was that I was trying to make this video where I could try my best to get you guys at least more than one flaming hoop per match. That way you guys would be able to get this one done quicker, or at least even if possible, get them all done in a single match. And one of the unfortunate things about this video here is that one out of the five of the flaming hoops are not close to the other ones at all so if you guys manage to go and find one that's not in the ones that I list here today that's fine go and do that one but if you guys do want to go and at least hit at least two or three of them maybe even all four of them in a single match you're gonna be able to see it here but we're gonna start off with the one that was a little bit far off the ways one that's really not gonna be too close to any of the four that I'm gonna be showing you after this so we're gonna be outside here of tomato town you guys are gonna be able to see that there is that big tunnel under there that underpass or whatever you guys want to call it just on the other side of it that's I guess more closer to like dusty divot if you want to say that side has the actual flaming hoop and so you can see that someone actually man made themselves the actual uh, ramp so that they can go onto the ATK I end up killing this guy here taking his ATK and then going over the hoop and then there's a little bit of karma situation going on over here but again this is one of the locations you guys can go to there are many other ones that you guys can go to but this is just the one that I decided to do while I was streaming and the other four the next four that you guys are gonna be seeing here are all relatively close to each other but if anything these last four remaining hoops here are relatively close to each other that you guys might be able to go and pull off all of them in a single match if not at least two of them in a single match now for the second location here we're gonna be going on top of stunt mountain now if you guys don't know what stunt mountain is basically if you guys actually go up there and you guys can see where I'm landing you're gonna be able to see that there's a bunch of trees at the top there. there's a lot of shopping carts there as well and as we look on the edge there you guys are gonna be able to find uh, one of the flaming hoops there it's gonna be kind of going all the way down towards the soccer stadium area so once you guys grab one of the carts there make sure you guys go down there and if you guys don't really land it right you might actually damage yourself if you start landing on your back or something like that so make sure that the cart always lands first so that you guys don't have any fall damage go through the flaming hoop and then you guys are going to be good to go now for the third location we're going to be going towards snobby shores if you guys still have your shopping cart from before you guys can go and bring that one over there but if you guys do go to snobby shores there are atks that are actually parked just outside of each of the houses so you're going to be able to at least find one of them there you can take that one and then go through the flaming hoop that's just off and just kind of outside snobby shores but not too far you really can't miss it because once you go outside you will see the flaming hoop so you can go over there go over the ramp there and then that's going to be another one in the books and then continuing down south for your fourth and fifth one there's one just outside of flush factory and then there's one actually inside flush factory so the clip here is going to be a little bit weird because i'm doing it backwards kind of as if i was going from a uh, pleasant park ish going south all the way to snobby shores going more south all the way down to flush factory but either way it won't really make a difference so this one here is just kind of outside uh flush factory outside the mountain and the front of it if you guys keep going there you're gonna be able to see that there's that big chair kind of statue thing you really can't miss this flaming hoop either this is also part of one of the challenges from last week it's kind of near a location for where uh, you had to shoot these clay pigeons you can be able to find this one here if you still have that atk you guys can go and take that one go up the hill a little bit up the mountain turn around go down and then you guys can go through the flaming hoop and then for the last and final flaming hoop here you guys can just go all the way back to flush factory of course again like i said the clip here is actually me starting in flush factory and then me going to the other place just before this one that I actually mentioned. The clips are a little bit weird, but it's not a big deal. But either way, you're going to be going here and you're going to be able to see the flaming hoop is just pretty much in front of the giant toilet there at Flush Factory. You're going to have to make yourself a man-made ramp. Some places do have a set ramp there already in front of the flaming hoops and some don't. So you're going to have to make your way towards the flaming hoop and then get your ATK and then drive it up there or the shopping cart, whatever is available, and then go through that flaming hoop. And then that's going to be all five of them. So again, guys, the challenge really isn't too difficult. The only thing was trying to make it so that I could get you guys a lot of these flaming hoops in a single match. That way you guys don't really have to stress too much. For example, if there was a flaming hoop all the way somewhere north, like in Jung Junction, and then the other one was in Paradise Palms, and that's just so out of the way from each other. So hopefully with this video, although the minor one that was kind of outside Tomato Town, hopefully this video is going to help you guys out. Hopefully you guys are going to be able to go and hit a lot of these flaming hoops in a single row, in a single match, and that way you guys can get this one done quicker, and make your way towards getting all of these challenges for week four completed, and then obviously going towards the road trip challenge to get you guys that secret battle star to 
towards your battle pass or a thousand XP. But that about wraps it up for today's video. But of course, before we end it off, I do like to leave you guys with a question that I want you guys to answer down below. Which skin do you guys like more? The fully upgraded Drift or the fully upgraded Ragnarok? I would love to know. Honestly, I like the Drift one more. It's just more of my thing. The Ragnarok one's cool too, but Drift is just more of my feel. But let me know what you guys are feeling down in the comments below. Drift or Ragnarok? I would love to know. But with that, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed today's video, remember to drop a like, subscribe if you guys haven't already, turn on post notifications here on the channel, but hit the bell icon below, and follow me on Twitter to stay up to date on everything going on regarding my videos, my channel, my streams, and myself. And of course, speaking about streams, guys, we're streaming a lot of Fortnite here over on this channel at youtube.com slash flip arts, as well as over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash flip arts live. Everything you need to know, down description below. Make sure you guys go and drop a follow and a sub on both Twitch and on YouTube. Hopefully, I'll get to see you guys in the stream sometime soon. Thank you guys again for watching. Catch you on the flip side. Arts out.